Dana and I are going to the six most popular islands in Greece. During our research, taking the ferry is much more reliable and for the most part, much cheaper. In this video, we will give you the complete guide on how to take the ferry from Athens to Peros. Make sure to stay tuned! We are Dana and JD, and we are working on moving to the Philippines. We quit our jobs and sold everything, right before the pandemic hit. We had to go on hiatus for a year and a half like everyone in the world, but as things slowly open back up, we are able to start traveling again. Follow us on some of our adventures on our way to the Philippines. Hey everybody, it's about uh, six o'clock and we are just leaving our apartment in um, Athens and we are going to catch the ferry for Paros here soon. So here we go. We were told to be at the port an hour early. Luckily we listened. We hit big traffic in the city and our taxi driver suggested that we got out and walked instead. We only had to walk for three to five minutes, but it could have been much worse. As long as you have your ferry tickets and COVID health forms, check-in should go smoothly for you. And don't worry, I will tell you how to get them both, headache free. There are a few ways of booking your ferry tickets, but after researching for days, Dana came across the Ferry Hopper app. It is easy to use and has everything you may need to make your trip hassle-free. Specifically for Athens to Paros, I chose Athens as my departure and Paros for arrival. Choose a date from the calendar and hit go. As you can see, it shows all of the available ferries for that date. All you have to do is choose whatever makes more sense to you. We chose Blue Star Ferries. Then you choose which type of passengers you and your party belong to. You can choose any available seats that suits your budget. In this case, we chose economy, but as you can see, it looks like they only have business and VIP for this particular ferry. Then enter your party's information and pay. Once your payment has gone through, you will see your booking at the bottom of the screen. You can check in and get your tickets all in the same app. Before you can get your tickets, you and your party each have to answer the COVID questionnaire if you are 18 plus. Once your questionnaires are done, they will email you a QR code which you will have to present along with your tickets. You can find the questionnaires in the online check-in link. A helpful tool we found on the Ferry Hopper app was the Ferry Tracker. It came in handy on our most recent trip to Santorini. Our ferry ended up being over an hour late due to severe weather conditions, and we knew exactly where it was, and it also provided the estimated time of arrival. We hope this will help you with any of your future travels. Please comment down below if you have any other questions. Yamas! Hey everyone, we just got to our hotel here in Paros. Um, it was 
is about like 10 minute walk from the pier to the hotel. It was hot and our bags were heavy. We're on the second floor, AC's going. We're about to go out and get some food, maybe go for a swim. Okay, everyone, this is the room tour.